Record. 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 I'm gonna get my funny fumos. Which I accidentally pressed the B button. The B button. The B button? So, yeah. With that bullshit aside, we are gonna play Radiant Dawn again. <laughs> a reason, time, a reason I, to fight? I don't need a reason to fight. I'm Batman. This time, this time we're going to play as the Dawn Brigade. Yeah, the, the what do they call them? The mid... The mid brigade? <laughs> I mean, honestly, I mean, honestly, Zeppi was not even wrong. I mean, most of most of my party members are mid. I mean, most of my units are mid. Yeah, like I think I only like like half of these units, and most of them are just units from Path of Radiance. Exactly. The Wait, ones I really like are Micaiah Soth, who is actually from Path of Radiance. We just didn't recruit him. Yeah. And we got we got Volg, who's actually somewhat helpful. Yep. Nolan okay. the goat. Yeah, Nolan is great. Yep, Laura's great. And we have Laura. Yeah, which she's worth keeping. Z-Hard. Yeah. Jill, Jill, obviously. Yeah, worth it. Nope. <laughs> nope. Aaron, no way. No. No. Who, who cares about <laughs> Edward? Fio Fiona is just awful. Her stats Her stat are really bad. Yeah, like I said, yeah, those stats are not workable. Yep. Leonardo I just don't care about. Yep. And Meg is Meg just a less good Braum. <laughs> yeah, she's just a less good Braum and even Gatry. Yeah. At least Gatry is easy to train. Yep. So... Both Leonardo? Who the fuck cares about him? So we don't like five of the units. Yeah, pretty much. The other seven are good, so it's not a good uh it's not a good ratio. Yeah, it's not even a good ratio. So we'll see how we can manage. That and night. I, <laughs> and this map is gonna stink. <laughs> hey, I'm serious. I'm serious, this map this map is gonna be awful. We've just begun crossing the river. This fog worries me. I can't see the other side at all. Ah, oh, when we first crossed the river, it was in triumph thanks to that tiny strategist. Remember that we called him Skipper from Madagascar? <laughs> oh yeah, Skipper. The penguin? <laughs> the penguin. Yeah. I actually I'm... have a few voice clips from from the penguin from the friggin' penguin. Yeah, you wanna play them? <laughs> Sure, but I'm sure, but I'm not sure if you can hear hear it from my phone. Well, you know if I do hear it. What do you mean? Well, I'll let you know if I do hear it. Okay. All right, give me a sec. I have to watch a stupid fucking ad. I'm surprised you don't have ad block still. Because I'm on my phone. Well, I also have ad block on my phone. Just get brave, bro. <laughs> Just get brave on your phone. Is it even connect? Is it even, you know, uh, associated with the app itself? Well, I just go, I just watch YouTube in the Brave browser, and it has no ads. <laughs> Alright, Jacob. I got it. <laughs> Let's hear it. The bad news? We've broken our last ship. Rico, you're on litter patrol. We need shovels to find more popsicle sticks. Don't want to risk another cave in. <laughs> that, that's great, I can hear it. Alright. <laughs> Come on, Skipper, you're hunting morale. I was defeated by a barrack. How can I return to Gallia with this shame? <laughs> there, there, there's, your, there's your Skipper <laughs> impression. If only I if only I died, I would have to suffer this humiliation. Skip a stop. 
If he had died, Galio had lost a brave penguin. <laughs> a brave you penguin. Know what, you know, at this point, both of them are going to be <laughs> the penguins <laughs> from Madagascar. And, and you I, literally got one of them, and you literally got one of them right for Ranulf. What, what do you mean I got one of them right? One of the four, one of the four penguins from Madagascar actually sound like that. Which one? Ranulf. Ranulf, what does he sound like? <laughs> exactly what you've done. Exactly what you voiced him. Well, what penguin does he sound like then? Is you it want me to? Is it, is it Kowalski? <laughs> All right, give me a sec. Also, I think I should move my chat box. It's kind of, uh, it's gonna be blocking my face cam. Just in case, you know, like, Zeppi decides to join or something. Oh, yeah, I think I know who... I think I know what penguin you did voice for Ranulf. Yeah, what? Private. Private? <laughs> That's actually his name. What if that private has like a high pitched voice? I mean, he does, but speak in some kind of weird accent. Oh, so it's the accent? Yeah. I see. <laughs> I see. Brave? I'm a failure? Please, leave me alone. Guys, leave me alone. Don't leave me alone. <laughs> Don't leave me alone. You know, Jacob, this is this is just a great start. We just <laughs> literally been talking about the penguins from Madagascar. <laughs> I mean, it's a good movie. <laughs> I know. Hey, Kai hey, Kaiza, do you smell that dude? <laughs> you smell that? There was also a show about about them as well. And the Penguins of Madagascar show. Wow, crazy. Yeah, both the movie and the show. Oh yeah, I voice him. I can't smell anything. What is it? Uh, maybe it's just my imagination, man. Life is your creation. <laughs> <laughs> imagination. Thank God. What kind of smell? And then Mr. Krabs comes out and he's like, the smelly smell. Yeah, from the very <laughs> first episode of Spongebob. <laughs> you know that. Hello, Captain Ranulph, dude. Uh, well, let's see. What is that smell, man? Oh, I know, dude. It smells like one of those torches at the Barrockies, man. What? Are we being pursued? I don't smell any barrack. That's because the wind is blowing from the other side. Oh no. Wait, shit, hold on. I gotta reopen my soundboard. Is it the. Is, are you gonna play the Knuckles one? I. I is, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> there we go. I have a bad feeling about this. Call a halt on the river crossing. Kaiser liar. Go tell everyone else. I'll make a run for the lead force and let them know. I just hope it's not too late. You know, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put a blanket over my uh my knees because I need some warmth. No, no, the enemy's here, dude. No way. I thought you hate. I thought you hate the. I thought you hate the heat. Well, no, it's just like my legs. They get kind of uncomfortable for sitting crisscross for too long. Yeah, I know that feeling. Laya, run to the left. Wing and inform them of the situation, Laya. <laughs> Not yet. Wait for them to get closer, everyone. Stay quiet. There's the lead force. Everyone, take your positions. Attack. And there's a kitty. You know what that means, Jacob? We are gonna fight against the Grail mercenaries. Aw, oh, shit. Well, 
at least oh, one, shit. at least uh, the units that are part of the mercenary, the grill mercenaries. <laughs> so you're just dead ass gonna leave out those five units? Yeah. Good idea. They're not. Yeah, they're not gonna be any use. All I can use is Jill. Oh. This is iHeart. Oh. Laura. Yep. Nolan. Not to be confused with Laura Art. Croft. <laughs> nope. <laughs> no. No. And friggin' Soth. And Micaiah. Those are the units that I'm just gonna use. Yeah, I really thought about how small the Dawn Brigade is. Yeah, you think? Yes, I think. <laughs> Let's see how I prevail against the, the odds. Fight. In upcoming chapters, the units you control will change. <gasps> no way. No matter who you face, your goal is to keep the units under your control alive. This is your primary concern. Yeah, this is what I'm this is what I'm talking about, Jacob. I'm literally gonna fight against my own army. I guess we have some yellow units too. Quite frankly, this chapter is kind of scary. Boo. Very, very scary. Oh, and it's a dark chapter too. That's also yeah, mid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Radiant Dawn featuring the mid brigade. This is gonna take a while. I mean, you can always turn off animations. But I love the animations. Well... <laughs> I guess it's gonna take a bit longer, then. Oh, uh, who cares, anyways. Well, I was playing Paper Jam earlier, and I was trying to get some S ranks in the boss ring, but I was kind of sucking at it. Now, these are the ones I really have to be careful with. Yeah, all of the Diegos. Oh, crap. Perfect well, damage! <laughs> well, at least Micaiah still does some good-ass damage. Even though she has terrible speed. Unfortunately, Micaiah doesn't dance like Ileana does, so... That's already a downside. That's an L. Well, no, dear. But I do like Micaiah's, um, summer outfit. Now that is peak. We have other characters that does have summer outfits. You've seen freaking summer earlier. <laughs> Makaya sucks by nuking with her tome. What do you mean nuking with her tome? Stay with me always, Makaya. I'll protect you with all I've got. I promise I will never leave you again. We've been together so long. I won't abandon you now, I promise. We can endure anything. <laughs> Look at So thinking he's in love. Well, it kind of is. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Nice crit, Dane. Looking, well, at, at, the, have... looking at the Thani animation. Ah. Well at, least, well, at least we have others that can help. <laughs> <laughs> I know they're crap. What what do they, what are they give the Dane soldiers like killer weapons? Last, we're getting ambushed, dude. Turn back, brothers. Turn back, man. Never. What did you just say, bro? We're the baby beast tribe. I'd rather die than be a coward, dude. Fine. No pulling back, dude. We stay here and fight to the last. All forces attack, man. Kitties. Lots of kitties. Well... Well, these are kitties that were... that we don't have. How come we don't have those kitties? Because they're evil. 
Well, actually, that would be unfair to call them that because... Because they will soon be our allies. Yay, more kitties! I got some more funny death noises that I can play for these guys. But hey, at least they will give me more EXP. EXP. This might give me enough time to give Laura more speed. <laughs> I added the fucking Leon death scream from Resident Evil 4. Oh, that's great. That is fantastic. Yeah, and I also have the Eggman dying that wheeze from the Snapcube dub. Whatever that is. I think it's this one? No, not that. <laughs> there it is. Oh, that's fun. It's gonna be really funny. Jill needs more strength, lol. <laughs> yeah, she does. Uh, yeah, she really does. Alright, here, here comes another funny sound for you guys. The ones that I'm gonna focus on are mostly... ...friggin' st strength and speed. Yep, those are the only stats that matter. I only need two, two level ups for speed uh, on Jill. Mm-hmm. She maxes out, I, she maxes out speed, quickly. Well, at least she can double the untransformed kitties. Yeah, untransformed kitties. <laughs> the fucking wheeze is so good. Yeah, I finished. I finished watching um, Lytheros, uh Silver campaign. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that's gonna get annoying pretty quickly. What the wheeze? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ooh, oh. support! Oh, surprise kitty! And it's playing the devoted. Now it's playing the devoted for some reason. <laughs> Okay, that actually makes sense, since, like I said, they are part of the Dawn Brigade. I mean, not, not part of the Dawn Brigade, I mean the Grail Mercenaries. <laughs> Leaf, you idiot, why would you fall back? The soldiers think that if we retreat any longer, we'd be throwing away our pride, dude. You're following the lead of some blood-crazed soldiers, man. You're supposed to be in charge. I know that tree is the same course of action, man. But if we run away now, dude, we'll lose the values that we hold dearest in our hearts, man. Fine, Leith. So long as it's your decision, not someone else's. I'll join the others in the back and watch of a skipper. We're counting on you, man. Oh. Oh, yeah, I voiced him. Hey there. You know, endurance is the key in battle. Never overexert yourself. Yes, thanks Thanks for your lovely words, Voldug. Wolf versus Diego. <laughs> and you miss. <laughs> Don't worry, you missed. Voldug, how are things holding up on your end? Call if you need anything. Bolu is gonna speak in pop culture songs. That's fine. <laughs> Here comes the kitty whooping. Yeah. Well, he got speed. And his axe leveled up. Poggers. Hello. 
Wow, Midkaya finally got a level up. And I got a terrible level up. <laughs> Midkaya. You know, I am not liking this at all. I am not liking this level up at all. <laughs> Alright, time to kill Gallia. Gallia himself. Oh, I just realized why you have, um, five yellow units. <laughs> because they are allies. Because they're standing in for the five units you didn't bring along. Also, holy shit, Jill. Four times? Yeah, she can quad. Damn. She's on par with Alincia now. <laughs> okay, just stop. <laughs> the fucking death noise. It's not even a good death noise. Dang, I thought it would be. Maybe Zack would like it more. Ooh. Yeah, that's Zep fine. Zeppy sent me some sauce. Oh yeah, what is it? Well, let's have a look. Um, let me go to his DM real quick. He sent Tifa. Ooh, I like I like me some Tifa. Yes, yeah, that's, that's some good sauce. Yeah, there you guys go. <laughs> Yeehaw, he said yeehaw, cowgirl Tifa. <laughs> what about, what about cowgirl Yuffie next? I don't think she, she exists. Yeah, sorry. Yuffie doesn't exist on that oh, timeline. Hmm, I guess it is actually faster to not have all 12 units. Because the yellow units just kind of act on their own, they don't have an animation. Dun, 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 dun. Roar. Oh. oh, more kitties. Oops, all kitties chapter. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that poor kitty is dead. <laughs> hey, that is a good level up. See, now that's a real level up. Not something that Mikaya would ever get. Leith, are you out there? Where are you, dude? Liar, what are you doing here, man? Leith, oh, Leith, you're safe. I'm so glad you're alright, dude. Why are you sneaking around, man? Get back into position, dude. How dare you, dude? I was just... Oh, forget it, man. I don't care what happens anymore. I'm sorry, liar. It's much too dangerous here, dude. Get back in position now. Oh, what, what the f <laughs> What the fuck are you doing here, bro? <laughs> the Black Knight is here? What the fuck? Oh, hey, I'm here, too. Ah, so night, you're safe. Where have you been? My maiden, I shall not ask why you chose to engage this battle. Well, I mean, she did become an emblem in like 10 games, so it makes sense. For that, you have my thanks. I am here to protect you. There, ne there need be no reason. <laughs> there need be no other reason. Do not leave my side. I understand. Then I should not ask why you've been absent. I want you to know I'm happy to see you again. I'm very glad you're safe. <laughs> I mean, I hate to bust your marble so, but I think the Black Knight's doing a better job at protecting Makaya than you are. Honestly, yeah, that's, that's pretty much true. <laughs> it's the Black Knight. It's the Black Man himself. Yeah, the Black Knight. One, one of the most... One of the strongest characters in the game. I mean, he's already level 20. <laughs> he's I got mean, Alan Tite and six concoctions. He'll be fine. I mean, there, there are a few... I mean, Jacob, there are a few chapters that I am going to use him. Dude has 40 skill. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Hmm. 
Maybe I shouldn't use my Brave Axe very often. I mean, I'd say save it for, like, genuinely good situations. Yeah, pretty much. Mm. Oh, no. Wow, 72 hit rate, that's rough. I mean, I thought it was a good amount of damage. You're good. Come on, Mikai, at least get a better level up. I want you to get back, friggin'. I want you to get at least one speed. <laughs> yeah, otherwise, Mikai is gonna be slow Kaya for the whole game. Yeah, she's gonna be slow Kaya. <laughs> Ew, he missed, bad character. Hey, at least no one's better than, like, Edward. Exactly. Yeah, I think that's enough to kill. So many kitties. Not really that big on the Dawn Brigade battle theme. I think the devote is way better. Jacob, there are better. Jacob, in my opinion, I think there are way better and way better music than the devoted. I mean, the devoted is already better than the mid brigade theme, so yeah. <laughs> it's the furry chapter. You just made it obvious. And <laughs> wow, Stealth is not going to get any doubles. Okay, thanks, Mr. Helpful. Dink. Well, at least he got strength. I will give him that. He's close to maxing out strength. He's strong. Nineteen remaining enemies. It's the furry genocide chapter. <laughs> That's what we'll call it. That's funny. <laughs> That could be- that could be a good title. I mean, since I don't have Not a better me. title... Dang, that, that archer's carrying. And he's not even on your team. He's just a yellow guy. He's not even gonna heal Soth, what the heck? Yeah, heal the yellow guy instead. Well, well Jacob, at least we are gonna have- we have the Devoted. If, yeah. if one of them attacks. Yeah, or or they're just going to keep attacking the yellow guys. Which, I mean, it is good, because that means you don't have to worry about sacking them. Like, sacking them is okay, basically. Wow, here, here comes all the units. <laughs> wow, they're surrounding that archer. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, you're here to killing edge for you. Well, we got an unnecessary crit. I mean, you have the killing edge. What do you expect? Think. I won't complain about that. Neither will I complain about this level up. Yeah, even Heather can get better speed than Soth. <laughs> I'm not joking. She literally, she she actually did cap speed before. Great. And that says a lot. That literally says a lot about. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Look at what Zeppi sent. What did he send? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I actually, I actually like this. <laughs> That is really funny. He's just sprinkling salt. I, I know that reference. I, I know that reference well, but I just forgot where that that's from. He's sprinkling the salt everywhere. I mean, I know that reference well, but I, I forgot where it's from. Uh, it's called the Salt Bay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I would be much happier if she if she levels up speed. <laughs> Idiot. Think. Fuck hey, you. Hey, look, guess what? She didn't get Miss Speed. <laughs> I'm 
You know, Jacob, you just ruined this episode for me. What do you mean? Because of your stupid soundboard. Wait, you're not on the move for sounds today? Damn. No, sorry. Bro. <laughs> Who said that? Me. <laughs> well, good. Nope. <laughs> well, at least she got I mean, magic. Ma magic, and we got olive oil grass, specifically the kind from Olive Garden. Who cares about Olive Garden? <laughs> I don't even know what Olive Garden is. I know what it is. <laughs> I think it's a restaurant or something. Yeah, it's some kind of Italian restaurant. Ah. Even though olives aren't even that amazing to begin with. They really aren't. They are not... Olives don't even have that much fiber anyway. <laughs> Need more fiber. <laughs> he has a 69% hit rate. <laughs> what Getting the fuck do you mean? Yeah, I know, I know it's kind of crazy, Seb, but Big Smoke is actually in Radiant Dawn. He's about to make his big appearance. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna walk up to Ike, and he's gonna be like, Ike, I need a number nine. <laughs> since when did Seb... Since when is Seb is here? Uh, he came to check out my stream because it has Big Smoke in the title. Well, yeah, uh, oh, great. The, yeah, but yes, uh, Jose's been playing Fire Emblem for the past, like, few weeks. I think a month now at this point. Yeah, it's gonna be a few months. Because we started it's it We started it back in June, I think? Yeah, it's June. Oh I yeah, banger music. Oh shit! Oof, now he's in real trouble. It's that now definitely in trouble because he's untransformed. <laughs> that feeling when the uh, the enemy phase battle theme is better. What do you mean this isn't Fire Emblem? This is a furry game. I mean, true. There are there are a little too many furries in this chapter for some reason. No dir. Well, Makai, it's time to use Sacrifice. <laughs> no way, I'm not gonna use Sacrifice. Welcome back to Makaya nukes a shit ton of tigers and kitties. So that's pretty much all that's gonna be happening. You gonna need to, you gonna do a rescue or something? Oh, okay, good. You have a vulnerary. <laughs> you forgot. Time. You forgot one thing about Makaya. What did I forget? Is it that she's cute? Because I already knew that. <laughs> How to double? <laughs> How does Makaya double anyway? See, even Laura gets better level ups than you, Makaya. Exactly. She slows balls? Well, yeah, we know that already. <laughs> I can't believe it's one of the few times where Jacob gets upset. What do you mean I got upset? 
because I'm not in the mood for listening to soundboards. Yeah, how could you? <laughs> yeah, sorry. I just not. I'm just not in the mood. Someone take your cheeseburger or something? <laughs> no. <laughs> That would be just as bad. Yeah. Cheeseburger. Now I'm gonna lay down because my legs are killing me. Now that is a that is a necessary crit. That's what we call that's what we call a necessary one. <laughs> Unfortunately he is dying. He's dying. Oh no. There we go. All good. I mean, I might get up when my legs feel better. <laughs> I love that guy. Can he join our team? He's doing a way better job than the other units. Oh, can we have okay, that? Can we have that guy join our team too? <laughs> that guy is also great. I like, I like how these guys are just dead ass stronger than your most of your units. Oh, they're kind of glass cannons though. All right, you only got to kill six more kitties and tigers, and then we'll be done. Oh yeah, we got to hear his bat battle music. <laughs> yep. I love how specifically the Black Knight, when you, you f play as him, he just plays his battle theme. He just says, nah, fuck the other battle themes. I'm playing my own song, bro. <laughs> oh my god! Hey, like a crit. Laura can crit. Oh damn it, Zeppy! You sent good sauce, and I have to get up and show it. Well, well, Jacob, consider this as a punishment. All right. Well, anyways, guys, here is the um the sauce that he sent. Ooh, now that's, that, that's 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 some good Makaya sauce. Yeah. All right, there you go. Yeah, that two damage ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> the two damage ain't shit. We are almost done. Thankfully, this chapter is not going to be an hour and a half long. <laughs> How long has it been? Um, 38 minutes. For, for, for once, we're actually going to have a short chapter. <laughs> Which is good. We haven't had one in a while. Yeah, it's basically a requirement of what I have to do. What the fuck is the shine barrier? So like something from Mario Sunshine, the shine barrier. She be floating. Everybody loves Mario Sunshine, you know. Except for the people that don't like Mario Sunshine. Come on, Mario Sunshine is good. At least you're cultured. Yeah. My favorite part of Mario Sunshine is when you boot up the game and Mario just says, Soup! Wow, that, that's unbelievable. I actually got all stats except for speed. Crazy. Don't you find this kind of ironic? I can play this game normally, or I can use the warp staff. <laughs> The warp staff. Oh, there goes another kitty. Yeah, keep attacking my yellow units. Or you could attack Laura. That's not good. Oh no! Okay, oh. never mind. You're fine. She, she missed? Okay. Oh, and she doubled too. 
Laura t See, Laura is actually a competent healer. She can defend herself. That's great. That's, that's, that's impressive, honestly. Oh, you ready? <laughs> I called it. <laughs> yeah, I got a crit again. Ah, if we keep this up, both sides would take horrible casualties. Ah, I can't find an opening, dude. If only I could find one weak point, man. We could break through. These guys are really clever. They must have a veteran commander to use a strategy like this. Ranulf, but what about General Skipper, dude? Isn't he supposed to be back at the army, dude? You know how he is. I've got six strong men trying to keep Skipper from coming out here. Alright then, dude. We'll show those Barak a real fight, man. We should regroup and... Wait, look over there. All troops, lower your weapons. I'm going to propose a ceasefire to the Goose Alliance. Well, that was easy. I've seen that black armor before. You're with the Dane army. Why is Dane attacking us? Are you a general of this army? I'm Micaiah, a general of the Dane Royal Army. The Mid Brigade. Wait, you're the one in command, dude? My king, Pelvis, has decided to end Zebenian's request for help in fighting the Laguz Alliance. You have no chance for victory. Further bloodshed's meaningless. Please surrender while you can. Did I insult us, tiny Barak dude? We'd rather die than surrender, man. Behind you lies the Banyan army. In front of you is the Dane army. You have nowhere to run, man. <laughs> Mikhail was supposed to say that, but whatever, I'm rolling with it. Idiot. Well, I guess we just have to chase you down like cattle and press on. Sound good to you, Skipper. That's a good answer. Thanks, Skipper. What in the goddess's name was that? Get back, Micaiah. That roar must be a lion. Lion Lagoos are stronger than a cat or a tiger. Lagoos, we've been fighting. F <laughs> Healers doing a good job attacking? This is a fake fire emblem. <laughs> hey, is that you, South? You look so much older now. Yeah, I grew up so fast. Just like Ike. Remember him, South? What? So Commander Ike really is fighting with you? Let's just say you shouldn't assume that you can see all of our troops. South, if you care for this girl at all, get her and her men out of here. That's my only warning to you. Wait. Stop, Micaiah. If we chase them, they'll kill us for sure. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Scroll up, homie. Yo, it's it's Jim Carrey! General Jim Carrey, what brings you out here? Has something happened to the king? No, but I am here to deliver supplies and to see the the battle of fairs. You've made you've made a clever excuse and convinced the king to let you come here. I'm impressed. Thank you for coming, General. Jim Carrey. Well, don't worry about it. I trust that the fighting is going well against the Lagusa Alliance. Yes, but the enemy seems to have additional forces deployed in that area. I expect another battle to begin very soon, and I doubt that it'll be easy as the last. So, still... So we still remain on the brink of battle, I see. I shall do my best to defeat the Lagoos Alliance quickly. The L.A. <laughs> the L.A. Yeah, the L.A. I get, I get that abbreviation, I really did. <laughs> when this battle is over, please persuade the king to negotiate a peace treaty as soon as possible. Would you do this for me? Would you please talk to the king and help to stop this pointless war? Well, I shall try, according to my calculations. Thanks, Jim Carrey. Ah, uh, finally we had a short chapter for once. The Dayan army takes to the field and deals a heavy blow to the army of the Lagoon. <laughs> he said blow. This sudden aggression shocks the Alliance like a lightning bolt on a clear day. 
Shock dodge. With their only avenue of retreat blocked, the forces of the Lagoo's alliance begin to despair. As the last shred of hope is fading, Scrimir appears before his troops and That's how you say his name, Scrimir. <laughs> the Gallian morale is further improved by the appearance Yo, of the Captain Falcon and Bike. Who aid the beast army with talent and steel. I like Skipper better. Rivals, rivals collide. Rivals collide. That hot, night. Hot and cold collide. Dane Army's working with Benyon? That's unexpected, to say the least. Why would Dane join the war? Couldn't they at least play F-Zero? <laughs> I thought all their resources would be tied up into reconstruction. Yeah, that bothers me too. There's something weird about all this. Didn't Dane resent Banyan's occupation? Why would they be so quick to help out their former enemy? Why, it doesn't matter. We're running out of time. We must deal with this quickly, if we're to get home. General Skipper, have you recovered from your wounds already? Yes, do not underestimate the healing power of the Beast Tribe. Alright, everybody's here, just like Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Let's begin the meeting. Mid Bros. Ultimate. Oh, the immediate threat is the Dane Army. They're dug in around the air that we'll have to use to cross the Riban. Maybe we could find another spot to cross. No, we can't afford it. If we waste any more time, the Central Army will catch up to us. If that happens, we're dead. <laughs> Randolph, tell me your impression of the Dane Army. Anything special? Yeah, there weren't very many of them, but their morale was really up there. Their commander seemed very clever as well. Must be the Maiden of Dawn. <laughs> Who? She was the hero of the recent Dane Uprising. Micaiah is her name, if I recall correctly. Supposedly, she's performed miracles and turned many losing battles into victories. An interesting figure. Oh yeah, she definitely has an interesting figure, I'll give you that. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were about to say that. Miracles? Isn't that Byleth's thing? I find that a bit hard to, to swallow. <laughs> That's what she said. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? <laughs> Who knows? Personally, I doubt it. All I know is that the Dane army believes in her miracles, which makes her dangerous. Oh, look at that. That's lovely. Ooh. The Man of Dawn is supposed to be the savior of Dane, whose miraculous powers freed their people from tyranny. In other words, her followers are fanatics who see her as a goddess. She'll make a formidable enemy. Yeah, I like how I like how Soth is just kind of photobombing in the background. He's like, oh yeah, I'm here too. If we attack him head on, the fighting won't stop until one side's decimated. There's got to be a way to avoid that, right? What about a decoy force like they've used in the past? Decoy only worked because the enemy didn't expect it. Not even Black Shadow. I, I wouldn't count on the same st strategy working twice. Not necessarily. The Empire assumes superiority over all other countries. Benyon's only using the Dane army as a pawn to stop us, and likely won't care if it's destroyed in the process. As such, the Dane army is most likely uninformed about our past tactics. You might have a point there. I went scouting after the fall cleared, and their forces really looked unprepared to fight us. They had no blister, and they hadn't f fielded uh, many fire mages. Felt like they didn't know a thing about fighting the goose. Then we should definitely have a decoy force hit them head on, with the bulk of the army crossing the river in the meantime. I'll head up the decoy force then. The armies of Galia and Phoenicus can cross the river while we fight. I'll go with you, Ike. Dane would get suspicious if they didn't see any Lagoos in the enemy force. 
Sounds like a plan to me. Take some of my men as well, if you want. I don't want their talents to get dull, nor my blue falcon. My blue falcon. Plague's alliance may have lost the war of might. But we haven't lost the war to save the lives of our brothers. This fight will be ours. Yes, with the fangs and wings of the Lagoos and the knowledge of the Barak, we'll return home. Dane cannot stop us now, Beavis. Just as they could not stop us during the Mad King's War. We can do this, okay? Is there gonna be is there gonna be a uh, pop up saying like oh you are now the Grail mercenaries lol? Nope. Like <laughs> Ike and Titania just staring at each other. Nope. No. Not yet. Yeah, a little B. And. <laughs> <laughs> Soren and Mia. Interesting combo. Hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> They're not even in the same battle now. I mean, if you want, you could always pair Heather with Ileana instead. And then try and get their support up. Nah. Nah. Nope. She still has to be with Laura. I mean, she doesn't have to be with Laura. Fine. You're stupid anyways. I mean, when is Heather even going to join back with Ileana, anyway? I don't even know. You ask me. Well, I'm asking you, because you've played this game. <laughs> I haven't gotten this far just yet. Hmm. Well, I'm assuming they're probably not available until, like, Chapter 4 or something. Great defense. I'm scared of this level up, but we'll see. Yeah, she got speed. Yeah, that's manageable. I guess. She is gonna max out speed soon. And I do like that. This will be the last time she'll ever level up speed, I hope. Pink. Not yet. Almost. Maybe another one. Maybe I'll try another one. I think. There you go. Oh, she has 24 speed? Yep. Damn, bro's got a lot of health. Well, that is rather fortunate, if anything. Sure. He's gonna promote. Yeah! Now he's a dragon lord. Yeah, he's a Draco lord. Good on you, Har, Venom Snake. Yep, good on you, Venom Snake. Pink. Fine, you'll keep that level up. Ooh! <laughs> Heather's gonna cap speed soon. That's great. Oh, she will. She is gonna cap speed soon. She already capped her friggin' weapon. <laughs> That's pretty funny. 
And now shopping time. Just like the... Just like, um, Junko and Raisin being a happy Bunny family. Yeah. What about it? I like that image. Me too. <laughs> Wyvern Lord with a different name. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Hmm, who is running low on weapons? Uh, aren't you gonna buy another, um, hand axe for someone? Eh, maybe. Yeah, Ileana's definitely running low on weapons. Oof. Nephany, yes. Oof. Definitely needs more weapons. Buy some shit. Thunder. Yeah, Eliana's been missing that L Thunder. <laughs> for real. Yeah, for real. What the hell does Shade do again? Okay, you want to see Shade? Oh. So, basically, the thing that... Yunaka has. <laughs> Reduce the chance yeah. that enemy will detect the unit and attack. That could be good on, like, um... Your healers. Okay, fine. Yeah, that's not bad. So, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> Twitter stinks, I'm leaving. Holy oh, shit. shit, that's a lot of guys. Oh, God. The Lagoos failed to cross the river. This is our last... This is their last chance to try. This time, they'll attack... ...with Barok as well. Seth, you know what this means. If we end up fighting Barok... I know. We'll probably be fighting the Grail mercenaries. I'm aware. It's not... It's not gonna be pretty. Seth, tell me more about Commander Ooh. Ike. Why? Why do you... You used to hate it when I said anything about him. I want to know more about the man I'll be fighting against. What kind of person is he? Well, let's see. He's... He's generous. He doesn't care about petty things. He holds no... Pre prejudice against the goose. Nor does he care about opinions of, of the nobles. He's a master swordsman. He accomplishes everything he sets out to do. He's a true hero. I see. He sounds quite different from King Pelvis. Yeah, because King Pelvis is a dweeb. Akaya, they don't even compare to King Kel... King Akechi. <laughs> King Akechi lacks anything. Lacks any leadership or decision-making skills. That may be, but I believe in King Ketchy. His heart's in the right place. I believe in his virtuous mission nature, and his commitment to being a good king. Even though he would set you up on a war that doesn't involve Dane at all? A war of Brigatorian hate? Fighting on the same side as a real enemy? You're smarter than this, Micaiah. Seth, we've been through this. I know we're about to fight Ike and the Grail Mercenaries, but I... It's time, shall we? Uh, those two are still here. So much for friendly advice, I guess. Now it's far to friends against friends. Things are getting crazy around here. Oh, you bet ya. See, this is what I thought the previous chapter was gonna be, but the last chapter was just kind of a kitty slaughter. Ike is a vanguard, not a swordmaster. Get it right, Soth. <laughs> yeah, he promoted, bro. Exactly. N Nia's the swordmaster. <laughs> well, I'm gonna take Titania because I love her. Yep.
Well, I have biases towards friggin' Ileana. Looks like a good team to me. Maybe I'll replace freaking Riz for Brom. Yeah. All right, All right it's, Jacob. it's chapter seven time. Right now, this is gonna be for real. I am gonna fight my own army. Yeah, and there's like 50 million units. What the hell? I didn't promote. He's still a unit that can learn soul. You steal men's souls. I mean, Micaiah will be... Honestly, Micaiah would be easy to take out. Considering that she has low speed. Wow, so they so they dead ass just have whatever you put on them. Actually, now that I think about it, she is actually close to maxing out her defense. I'm not joking, she's actually close to maxing out her defense. I can see that. I don't know if... Oh, I'm definitely gonna plan to fight. I'm gonna I'm definitely gonna plan to friggin' Get Heather closer to South just to fight. Yeah, I'm gonna make them fight. So now my, my here's my question: How the fuck are you gonna beat this chapter? By twelve, by surviving in twelve turns. Oh, you have to survive. I was about to say like, <laughs> the, the, he's got the Black Knight. How the fuck are you gonna win this chapter if the Black Knight's there? So you got you gotta avoid the Black Knight then. Oh shit. I know. But I have to find a way to defeat Micaiah, though. Even though it, I don't think it's necessary. I mean, if it would say, like, defeat Micaiah to end the chapter. But it doesn't say that, so... It just says, survive. The characters you defeat in the enemy army will not die. Yeah, thanks, game. I could prob I could guess that, probably. Concentrate on the units under your control and fight with all your skill. I don't, I don't think, really think it needed to say that, but you know what? Thanks, anyway. Yay, Ike's okay. theme! I mean, honestly, you could just, like, stand there and not do anything. <laughs> and just have the enemies come to you. <laughs> That's not gonna happen, you know. Dang. There's gonna be reinforcements. Oh. Yeah, it's time to cure up the retard sword. I'm not a- and I am not afraid to... Eh, bro- Hey, Brom, you, ca you can't be going anywhere off alone. Here, let me help you. Oh, that's a fine thought. I'll do my best. Oh, I love those two. They're great. They are a great duo. I will say that. <laughs> name, name a more iconic duo in gaming. <laughs> Not yet. After this stream, we are going to talk. <laughs> we got to talk. Yeah, we gotta talk. No, I mean, dude. Here he comes. Without the advantage of an ambush, this fight's sure to be tougher than our last one. Wow, great turn you guys had there. I'm going to do this without any hesitation. No hesitation. Heather, you're, you're alright. I don't know. How could you be under these famine, famine conditions? Hey, you still fine? Personally, I have to keep going. I haven't made half of what I bet I could take him for. Punch. Fuck you, Heather. <laughs> Just punch her in the face. <laughs> Aha, Eliana. Today's battle paint playing well. I mean, faring well. <sighs> Let me know if I can help. Oh, hello. I'm so hungry. If you can spare some rations. <laughs> Poor Eliana. <laughs> Nothing's changed. <laughs> yeah, she is always hungry. Poor Eliana. Yeah, I forget what that disorder is called, where you're just always hungry. Alright, 
time to send in my best units. I will try to finish this chapter quickly. I am yeah. thinking if I'm actually planning to attempt to do three chapters. Mm, I was planning to just do two chapters. <laughs> if we can finish this quickly, we could. Well, I tell you what, if you, can, if you can finish this under an hour, then yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't need to crit! I love the Black Knight. Oh crap! No! Oh, bye, missed. I mean, nine hit rate though. I think. Although she just tries to defend herself by throwing her staff. Uh oh. Oh, actually, that that's a good thing. Thanks, Captain Falcon, for sending in some bird ups. Yep. Thank you, Captain Falcon. I thought those were reinforcements, not, like, helping at units. You, you got scared, didn't you? Yeah, I, I, I dead ass thought there was, like, reinforcements. Oh, that crit, I, I like. Dead ass, she, she literally got a crit. God, I really love this song so much. Yeah, this is peak F.E. right here. Yeet. Oh, dude. Oh, no, I missed. Yeet. You do not want to fuck with this, mommy. <laughs> Don't fuck with this, mommy. And hey, her weapon leveled up. SS Axe now. <laughs> oh, she is. She might be the first one to be capable of carrying the Irvin. Nice. Nephany, what do you what do you say? Want to try facing them together? Please, that'd be a fun thing. The only reason why she spike. avoided is because the only reason why she avoided is because she got in a she she literally maxes out speed. I'm not joking. She actually did max out speed. I mean that definitely helps. And also just because the enemies just constantly have shit hit rate. If it's hard mode, then they would get better hit rates. <laughs> they would actually feel like normal mode. No, that would be bullshit mode since I really can't see the enemy's range. Oh. You want me to fast forward? I mean, you could if you want. Or she could get soul. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is the keys on for me? It should be. <laughs> yeah, me again the crit. Crit queen time. At this point, she doesn't even need level ups. <laughs> Mia she has peaked. Fast. She is fast AF. Yeah, because she just constantly doubles. Oh. That's not gonna do shit. Oh, wait, it did. <laughs> it did do shit. Soren's dead, basically. <laughs> oh, here comes the birds. Guess it's time to heal up Soren. I mean, yeah, typically Soren isn't very tanky, he's very frail. I know that's never changed. Nice. 
she she maxes out skill out of all <laughs> out of all the stats. Hey, I mean, that gives her a chance for more skills to kick in. <laughs> Ileana's so hungry that Snicker bars can't even make her not hungry. Well, I want a Snickers. I had Hershey's. <laughs> I know it's not the same, but I had I just had it just saying. Is it the shitty American Hershey's though? Yeah, unfortunately. Dang. That's too bad. You gotta, hey, it's chocolate. You gotta, hey, it's chocolate. Chocolate's chocolate. You gotta try the real the real Hershey's. <laughs> what, in Canada? Yeah, can Canadian Hershey's. Wonder how they taste. Way better. <laughs> Plus they have lots more kinds, like cookies and cream and Hershey, oh, actually, Hershey's and almonds. Well, there, there is... There is... Uh, we actually do have them here in America, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's just that I don't have it. But I... I just ran out all of the almonds. I just ate all of the almond packets. <laughs> the almond ones are good. I, I wouldn't mind getting some. Yeah, unfortunately, I had to deal with the regular ones. You know what? I'm not gonna fucking hesitate anymore. Yeah, I mean, you're already on turn four. I also sent sauce, because I'm not sure if you've seen it. I'll have a look. Yeah, yeah, sure. Let's, let's, let's look at the sauce that Zeppi sent. Uh, so, he sent uh, some Marissa. Edgy Rissa? Fire Rissa? <laughs> And Micaiah in a... Is that a, like, office outfit? <laughs> no, it's a pajama. Oh, pajamas. Yeah, EP, Micaiah. I, I, I like Fire Rissa and, and Edgy Rissa. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, it's basically Micaiah being EP. That's what people says anyways. EP Micaiah? Hmm. Yep. Oh, that's bad. That's bad, has 54 hit rate. I mean, Jacob, what do you expect? It's a crossbow. Of course they're bad news. <laughs> bad news. Both from Lost Word. I mean, I'm still convinced that Lost Word ripped off the Red Marissa from Toho 12.3. Because technically that game came first. Edgy Rissa, though, I think that's new. Damn, bro, I can't believe Micaiah is from Lost Word. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, no! See, I, I knew this was about to happen! What, getting hit with a crossbow? Yeah, you know how dangerous crossbows are. Relax, bro. You took 10 damage. That's only one-fourth of the health. Yeah, that's not much. It may not seem much, but wait until I get to enemy phase. That, I just don't like that, that <laughs> chance. I don't like that guy. Oh, perfect damage. Nephany to the rescue. Well, perfect damage as long as she doesn't miss. <laughs> it's an 88% chance, so she'll she'll be fine. See? <laughs> I don't know. We've had we've had weird cases in Link Arena. Try Thracia seven seven six. It has horrible. It has horrible hit accuracy. Well, that just does not sound fun. You want to you want to hear something unbelievable? What? There is a chance that you can actually get hit by a one percent hit ratio. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, that that could be either extreme an extreme luck or extreme. Or you could just. Or you could just be extremely unlucky if you get hit by a 1% hit rate. <laughs> That's gonna miss. 
GameCube Dolphin GameCube Dolphin emulator gets achievements. Bane. Yeah, you're, yeah, you're dead. Yeah, bye. Lol. Bane is actually useful. What does it do? Basically, it lowers your lowers your health to one percent. Oh, that explains why he had one health left. That can actually help if help if you can double. That is good. You got a one percent crit. That's really funny as well. I mean, honestly, one per one percent crits are still scary, nonetheless. Seven percent crit. <laughs> How about that? I usually forget that daggers are throwing weapons. Yeah, I mean, Yanaka throws them a lot. Or is it knives that are more like throwing weapons? I forget. Well, I know Marin throws knives in Engage. Wow, Brawl really hit with his 63% accuracy. Time to rescue. <laughs> yep. I feel like I'm going to complete this map quickly. Well, you're half done, so yeah, maybe. All because I'm not hesitating. Well, that's good. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything. Look at Brom. He's tanky AF. Tanky man. Yeah, even double's not gonna help. Yep. Don't even think about hitting the speed queen. <laughs> the speed queen. I was just like, whoa, is that a breeze? I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. Wow, what a pussy! He healed! Looks like we're on turn seven now. Oh shit, he got a longbow. But that's not gonna do anything. <laughs> He's got a longbow! Zero percent hit rate. <laughs> and 13 hit rate and one damage. 
That's just sad. <laughs> the enemies either have no hit rate or no damage. <laughs> oh, he is dead. Bro is dead. You see, this is why I love Heather so much. Is Bane just like her natural ability or what? This is... This is the ability that rogues have. Or at least, that's what whispers have. Ah, oh, it's a pretty damn good class then. Please surrender now. I don't want to kill you unnecessarily. Okay, that's pretty bad with oh. that. With that you... kind of hit rate, that's... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, pretty bad. 27. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm turning back for now. I really suggest that we all, you retreat as well. Hey, no fair. How come when they're not our units, they get the uh, casual mode rules? That's bullshit. Thanks, Captain Falcon. Oh! <laughs> Oh, I just realized it's Jan Janeth and Olki. That makes wow, it even like... cooler. Those guys that are real ones. Sixteen fifty. <laughs> oh, Bane activated again. That's good, actually, because she wouldn't have killed otherwise. Not only is she the speed queen, she is the Bane. She is the Bane queen. Oh, missed opportunity to call her the Death Queen. <laughs> or the Death Queen. Because that's a real... that's a real name. <laughs> she maxes out 20 magic! Wow, she doesn't even need it. Is that either a wasted level up or somewhat a good level up? I mean, it's whatever. She just needs to max out her speed now. Hmm. So I guess I guess thieves type characters can be good. And Brom gives no fucks. I send some sauce to Hose A. Heh, <laughs> Hose A. Hey. And you sent some sauce to me. Perfect. I'll have a look at that once the turn is over. Ooh, nice! I like it what I'm seeing. I think. Wow, one luck. Should All I right. even load a save? Because that was awful. Nah. Anyways, he he sent me more Marissa. Well, that's like that's like super goth Marissa. What the hell? He sent me some. Oh, he I like sent me it. some images of Heather. Ooh, that's good. Heather is a ninja. Probably find and... better Heather sauce than me. And Heather and Nephany again. I like it. I do like, I like Heather and Nephany. Yep. <laughs> and I sent I sent both you guys that Romilia picture and the Junko and Buni art. That is some nasty damage. Nasty. Bird up. <laughs> he gives no fucks. Oh no, more reinforcements. Yeah, I think Soren really needs more speed. <laughs> yeah, he's having the same problem as Makaya. He's too damn slow. Should I even bother? Mm, I wouldn't bother. <laughs> it's gonna take longer to get to the third chapter if you do that. Who the fuck cares? <laughs> I care. I just want good stats, okay?
You better believe it that I am very picky. Especially like that. <laughs> and and Heather getting Bane yet again. See why she's called the Death Queen? What a good name. The Death Queen. Got another healing. Wow, Titania can't even move. <laughs> yeah, because she can't she can't like go across the water very well. Nope, sadly not. Dang. Kinda reminds me well, of that kinda reminds me of that sand chapter. Where armor knights and like paladins couldn't go anywhere. Say so, Jacob, has it been half an hour? Uh, we're at an hour 26, so if we should be able to get to a third chapter. I mean, if you can finish this, if you can finish this chapter at like the hour and a, at the hour 35 mark, I think, yeah, we could definitely do another one. Because an hour and a half will be too short of an episode. Ileana dancing again. Just what I needed. <laughs> oh, I just got lucky. The Ranulf kick. Oh, the, are you guys sick of Bane yet? Well, here it is. <laughs> oh, shit. Battle it's, of the waifus. It's my girl. My friends, it grieves me to meet again under these circumstances. Jill X Nephany? <laughs> it's too bad that she's gonna die. Yep, yeah, sorry, Nephany is just too strong. Or not, she's gonna get healed up. Oh no, the birds, they're, they're not transformed anymore. Redhead versus blue head. What do you mean blue head? Nephi's green, dude. She's a green head, not a blue head. Oh, impale! <laughs> oh, damn, that's brutal. Yeah, she's dead. She is literally dead. <laughs> Fuck off. It's it's Mario versus Luigi, bro. And that's a oh, good level. Oh, that is good. That is fucking good. They're so strong. Even stronger than three years ago. Lady Micaiah, I apologize. I must head back for now. What and the she... Now she's wow, S, -S she Lance. Ma <laughs> she maxes out spears? Very Finally. nice. Finally. It looks in the battle animations. I guess because of her blue helmet. It makes her look like she's got blue hair. Bane, again. Um, yeah, she is gonna pierce through Armor Knight. Jacob, she is literally a death sentence to anybody. Actually, everybody. <laughs> if she uses Bane. You know, I'm, I'm gonna call this episode Bane of Your Existence instead. <laughs> That's a better title, I think. Yeah, it is a nice ring to it. It's better than Furry Genocide. <laughs> Uh, finally, he's transformed. All right, can a cat take down a dragon? No. The answer is not quite. It would have. Cr it would have been a good opportunity if he crits. <laughs> Way better. And Titania's gonna finish it off. Yeet. Titania to the rescue. I mean, getting an axe thrown at your dragon will probably hurt. <laughs> Do you have an idea how disappointed I'm, I'm, I am with these levels? Why? She got strength. I just want two specific level ups right now. Once 
she's promoted into the third tier class. So of course I'm going to be this picky. <laughs> You're not even going to attack Ileana since she's very frail? <laughs> Nah, <laughs> they're like, nah, I'll leave the rations girl alone. Oh, yeah, that's what you get for attacking me, bitch. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, it's no contest. Heather is definitely better than Yanaka. Heather can just instantly kill any enemy. <laughs> I mean, technically, Naka has better evasion, but that's about it. What? Oh, the Black Knight? <laughs> yeah, I don't think Heather would have any chance to fight. <laughs> yeah, no. Black Knight, Black Knight was like, "All right, I, I've I've seen all this pain." What happens if I, what happens if I actually kill Nakaya? Hmm, it's worth a try. Just as you have a reason to fight, so do we. Also, ooh, what's this music? This might be a scary outcome, Jacob. Wow, Nakaya has her own boss music. I actually like this music. Yeah, too bad she's piss easy. My wounds, they're nothing. They're nothing compared to what my people have suffered. We won't lose. We'll never give up. Oh, she just pissed off. That was it. <laughs> I'm still worried about what's going to happen. Well, I, we always have a safe state to fall back on. Just in case. Alright, I'll... I'm gonna end the turn after so, I do this. So Makai gets her own battle thing, that's cool. Yeah, Heather beats Yunaka. I, I feel like Heather... It's hard to say who beats who, because Yunaka has, like, infinite evasion and avoid. But Heather has the potential to one-hit KO anything. <laughs> so, it's a hard competition, honestly. I feel like I actually, in, in, real, in actuality, it would probably just be a stalemate. <laughs> oh. Wow. 18%. It's gonna be funny if the Black Knight just waltzes up and kills Heather. <laughs> that would be upsetting. Oh no, she actually took damage. I don't think the Black Knight... Can the Black Knight even hit her now? Yeah. Oh no, you're still dagger. Oh no, I'm getting, he's getting healed. Wow, they're just all jumping her. They're actually cor they're actually cornering her. Nile. Wow. Uh oh. <laughs> Stand aside. You are no match for me. Uh oh. <laughs> you better hope. You, you better. Okay. You better hope he doesn't hit. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. I can't save her anymore. They actually. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> that was scary, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, that was great. Crap, no! Oh, she's dead. She's fucking dead. Damn, I can't save her. 
She's not dead. The Black Knight can't even reach her. Yes, she. Yes, he can. He can. Yes. Well, I don't know. Just see. Just see what happens. And, and the worst part of it is that I actually save state. Well, we'll see what happens. I mean, he has like a seventy percent hit rate, so there's a chance. He, there's always a chance he misses. And plus, the plus your, these other units might be stupid enough to block him from even attacking. As long as she, thank goodness, receives okay. vulnerary. She's safe. Thank goodness. <laughs> Nile, two damage. Nile just blocks. Any skills? Okay, yeah. Uh, I for I forgot. Oh, <laughs> there's a crit. I forgot that his sword is too um too range. But yeah, he yeah he's not attacking her, so she's fine. Okay, this chapter is over. Oh, Janeth, the king is calling us. All right, good. Looks like we did it. Like the main force crossed the river, we did it. Excellent. Everyone, push through. Let's meet up with the main force. Yay! Okay, this chapter is finally over. And you beat it at 1 hour and 37. It's not bad. Beast soldiers are behind us. We're being attacked from behind, dude. The galleons? How did they cross the river? It's not just the beasts. There are hundreds of hawks as well. Even the hawk tribe is here. The Benny and Ami never told us that they had moved out. The goddess, Commander Ike's force, was a decoy. Staying away increased casualties. Let's retreat. No, man, we can still fight. Please give us your orders. I have. We shall retreat. I'll not let all of you die in vain. But... General's orders. We have to keep our losses to a minimum. That's enough for this battle. Yes, sir. Mikaya, I'm surprised. This is the first time you couldn't protect, I mean, predict the enemy's movement. You're right. Bakaya! Bakaya, what's wrong? South, don't. Just act normal. Everyone is watching. Oh. Bam, 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 bam. Gain keep. Did <laughs> it? What? Mikaya failed to eradicate the Lagus Alliance? No! Who voiced him? You gave him the little Bono voice. <laughs> what do you mean? You gave him the Hey Paisanos! <laughs> oh yeah! I remember. Hmm, this looks bad! King Akechi, is this how the people of Dane repay Benyon for all the kindness it offered them? I'm afraid Dane and the Senator Armstrong's friendly relationship stopped here. I really hope the Super Mario Bros. Super Show doesn't <laughs> cancel here. Please wait. Give me one more chance, I beg you. <laughs> Give me one more episode. <laughs> Give me one more episode so I can drink with Adachi. Well, well, Paisano. Since you begged, I suppose I will consider it. Of one last episode of the Super Mario Bros. Super Show. Please, just listen. Dane remains loyal to the Senator Armstrong. We will carry out any task given. Your whim is our command. Just please give us another chance. I want an order of... of another Super Mario Bros. Super Show season and another season of Johnny Test. <laughs> <laughs> the whims of fate. Very well, Paisano. We shall overlook your failure this one time, but only once. Farewell, Paisano, King of Dane. You go to hell and before you die. Go to hell before you die. <laughs> well, he just sees the warp staff. Elvis. Mother! That man you were speaking with, he's a Senator Armstrong from Benyon, correct? Um, how, what, how do I say his name? Uh, Duke Luobano from Gados, I believe. He was here before as part of the Empire's inspection team. He came in Duke Persian's stead. 
Yes, you are quite right, Mother. Vice Minister Lee Kane of De of Bengyan, you saw us together, right? Tell Mother what happened. You look absolutely terrified. Does that man have something on you? Is he trying to hurt you? It's all right to tell your mother that. No, it's quite all right, Mother. We were talking about the future of our two countries and how we might repair our nations. Perhaps they are talking about the future connected. Please go back to your room. I shall go rest. I will find myself. I am I am rather tired because I kept fighting Joker. Now go to your room, Mom. Elvis, wait. Oh, my son. All right, yeah, we, we got time for another chapter. As long as it's like 40 minutes long, like the other ones have been. We might keep the streak going. Yawn. The diversion created by the Grail mercenaries. Ooh, more sauce? I want to see. Oh, my goodness. That's some booba. Holy shit. When did Ivy get buffed, bro? their relentless pursuit of the Alliance. The weakened alliance is forced to a Jacob, Ivy was always busty. What do you mean? She's bustier now. One of my friends actually like her. I mean, who doesn't like her? All right, so we got well, Sk we got Skipper, Captain Falcon, and Zelgius. Well, considering the fact that my friend enjoys drawing Ivy with Makoto Yuki. Okay, that's a bit weird, but all right, I won't judge. <laughs> Jacob, you enjoy both Fire Emblem and Persona. <laughs> sounds like a bad sounds like a bad Wattpad bit waiting to happen. <laughs> Why don't you talk to TMS? Who's that? Basically, TMS is just Tokyo Mirage Sessions. Oh, yeah. You're right. How are we doing for time, Janaf? Bobby? They're gaining on us. Their lead force is about, let's say, one day off. You've got to be fucking shitting me, man. How did they cover so much ground since yesterday? They're definitely moving faster than we expected. At this rate, they'll catch us soon. Any ideas? With the enemy closing in so quickly. It would be unwise to use the secret passage. <laughs> Ike, stop acting unwise. If Benyon found it, it would give them an open invitation to surge across Gallia. We can't, will not be pleased. we can't expose our country to that danger. We have to think of something else. Well, we can't start a fight in the Serenus Forest. And we definitely can't do danger strats either. Besides the terrain disadvantage, the forest isn't fully healed. We can't risk burning it down again. Soren, any ideas? Our options are profoundly limited, Ike. It appears our only other option is those caves up ahead. Caves? Oh yeah, those are the, Ku the Kaku Caves. We don't want to go there. It's a complex maze full of lava and ash. Not exactly a place you want to rest. Oh, Jacob, I think you might be, f be familiar with the map. Oh, is the map from Engage? Well... It's more like this map is originally from this game, and the one that you've seen in Engage was originally from this game. Yeah, 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 I get it. Jacob, you need... <laughs> <laughs> Jacob, you really have to be a lot smarter. I know, what I, I know what I said. The legends say that through the caves, there's one exit that leads to Godot, and another exit that leads to Gallia. What do the legends say, though? The fact that it's suicide to go in there. We don't even have a map. Well, maybe ask the merchant. He has maps. However, the more you hens carry on, the closer the enemy advances on us. They're now less than a day away. If the enemy catches up to us in this forest, we'll certainly die. The caves are known to be dangerous, so Benyon may not pursue. Even though its formidable natural hazard is nearly isn't de as deadly as an intelligent living enemy, we must go to the caves now. All right, Soren, I trust you. Let's move out for the caves. Woo! And I think I think the Zepmeister sent more uh, sauce. Oh, uh, more ivy. Oh yeah, he sure did. I like what I'm seeing. <laughs>
I really want that. Yeah, o yeah, Olky's Ol 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 always had an ASMR voice. <laughs> Who? Olky. Okay. Are you sure? We have visual confirm confirmation of the Lagoose Lag Alliance heading into the K Kaku's cave. Yes, sir! The enemy may be desperate. Why else would they enter to this forsaken trap? Oh yeah, we Kurt Cobain's go. back. We cannot go there without preparations. It must be suicide. Let's not, f let's not follow them to their deaths. That ends our pursuit, then. Tell the men this mission is over. I cannot allow you to do that, my dear general. You're... <laughs> yes, Senator Valtome. <laughs> You're not even a tiny bit surprised, Lord Zelgis of Cador. What a frightful boy you are. I came here in secret just to surprise you. Oh, I am surprised indeed. What would, what would bring a senator of Armstrong of your station to be in a place like this? Do you bring new orders? <laughs> oh yes, I'm here to deliver a decision handed down by my Senator Armstrong. In its wisdom, the Senator Armstrong has appointed me the Commander-in-Chief of the Peely Army. From this moment on, this army is mine. I see. Then I am your command. Then I am at your command. Your orders, Commander. Also, how the fuck did Black Knight go from Black Knight to Zelgis? How do you go how do you do that so fast? Was it the warp staff again? Yeah, it's probably the warp well, staff. You could say that, well, you could say that the Black Knight is basically his alter ego. Oh, well, that doesn't really answer my question, but whatever. <laughs> oh, you're ever so serious. You haven't changed one bit, Selgis. Well, what questions do you want to ask? Like, I'm just saying, how did he go from Black Knight and all he went? Like, he was, he was with Makaya like 10 seconds ago, and now he's all the way over fucking here as Selgis. Well, it is possible that he did use the warp staff to follow Ike. Yeah, I'm surprised well, he did I mean, it that quickly. Well, I mean, the funny thing is that it is possibly intended that after Micaiah loses, uh, he, 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 he just dips and then goes back. <laughs> well, Zell just did change his armor. Did have to change his armor in disguise just to follow Ike. Wow, that's crazy. One of these days, I will catch you off guard. Well, I suppose that impassive face of yours is just part of your charm. Senator Valtom Armstrong, your orders. Oh yes, orders. <laughs> well, this battle's taking far too long for my taste. We'll pull back and conquer Gallia by taking a different path. I see. Then I shall inform my men. The Northern Force will stay here. Tell them to go inside the caves to search for bodies of dead subhumans or something. What? Send sending them. In, I mean, <laughs> sending them into those caves is the same as sending them to the gallows. I implore you to reconsider, Commander. I gave my orders, did I not? Get those men in those caves right this minute, man. And Selgis, never question my orders again, or I'll have you killed. Is that clear? Besides, you should be happy. You're coming with me to finally wipe out those beasts. Come along now. Uh, He's just so the, disappointed. The, the cock caves. <laughs> Wounded. And siblings. You got Daunt. Now it's time to manage. Well, while you're doing that, I'm gonna go make me a bagel. So I'll be right back. Cause I'm hungry. I'm like Ileana now. You're always hungry, Jacob.
Finally! Finally, she maxed out speed. And he maxes out strength! Finally! Now it's time to sell some stuff. Absolutely. Alright, did I miss anything? Well, I'm about to give Daunt to Ileana. Ooh. It says reduce the hit and critical percentages of all enemies within three spaces. I mean, it's something. Well, I mean, it. Well, I mean, it could help me. Well, it could help me reduce any longbows and stuff. Oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, sure, I'll give it to her. Though I'm not sure who I would give friggin' coercion to. Hmm. Honestly, I don't know. Nobody needs coercion. Maybe I should sell it. Well, 
first of all, Zeppi sent me some sauce. Who is that? Come is okay, is that who I think it is? Yep. Oh hell yep. yeah! We got Bunny Camilla. I like that. I like the I like I, the, I like the, I like the mommy, the mommy dragon. Well, Jacob, I'm well, Jacob. I am sorry to say this, but I am very mixed on Camilla. Why you don't like her boobs? I just. Well, I mean, I do like her breasts, I will say that, but I just don't <laughs> really like... But I just really don't like her psychotic personality. She's psychotic? Yeah, she's actually a psychopath. She she is willing oh. to kill anybody. Huh. So like Yunaka? No, not like Yunaka. But Yunaka loves killing people. Does she? I mean... It's pretty serious. Well, Jacob, I just gave all my level up, all the bonus EXP to Heather. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And look, and look how she turned out. Thirty-eight speed. Yep. And I actually found out that I actually have an an energy drop. Oh, nice. But I gave it to her because I love because I love freaking. Oh yeah, and I also gave. Ileana EXP <laughs> to max out her speed. Holy shit, she maxed out four of her stats. Yeah, she does. She won't max out any other stats like freaking defense and resistance. <laughs> Although I will say that her resistance looks good enough. Yep. <laughs> She's literally just protecting corn. Oh yeah, and I also, I also level up Braum. Yeah. He maxes out strength. Good. Which honestly, I will say... He's gonna be at his best once I once I try to focus on leveling up Rez. That's peak Braum right there. Well, what can I say? I think Braum is amazing. Oh yeah, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jacob, I actually have an idea of what you should voice him. What? Try to give him the Luigi voice from the Super Mario Bros. Super Show. <laughs> Hmm. I need to remember how he sounds. Why? Why do I why do I always get stuck with these awful missions? That's CDI Luigi. Um. You should say. Okay. Where is where is my? Phone? Oh, there it is. I actually have a perfect sample of what he sounds like. Well, you want me to do Super Show Luigi or Mario World Luigi? <laughs> Okay, give me a sec. <laughs> Come on. I need I need that funny video. <laughs> Come on. Is that an everything bagel? Yes, it is. They're pretty damn good. You hear that? No. Jacob? You still don't hear anything? Mm-mm. Fine, I'll send you a link. Will that make you feel better? Okay. Based. Yeah, I am Blech. based. I like ba I like everything bagels. Here it is, Jacob. Yeah, I mean then that way I can play it on stream. <laughs> See, that's the one that I want you to go for. Why? Why do I always get stuck with these awful missions? <laughs> I should have cur cur curried favor with General Zelgis. Why don't you do him a favor and give him pepperoni cheesecake? Pepperoni cheesecake? Then perhaps I wouldn't have had to step in these ghastly caves. With pepperoni cheesecake? <laughs> hey, I like, we have company and pepperoni cheesecake. Seems that way. 
What kind of numbers are we looking at? I can't see through all this smoke and heat. Where there's smoke, there's fire. It's just like Soren said, a token force. As far as I can tell, Zelges isn't leading them. That helps things. We have to keep the enemy away from Skipper and the others while they're looking for an exit. Let's proceed as planned. We have enough people here to deal with these clowns. Everyone ready? Ha, <laughs> he said clown. We're set. Let's finish this and get out of here. <laughs> that tastes terrible, lol. Holy Pe shit. Pepperoni everything. cheesecake. Here are the new units that I get. <laughs> I get... I get... Uh, Uki and... Uh, Bobby Hill. Yep. Are you gonna use them? I mean, their stats look... Decent enough. You know what? I wanna... Unless well, well, they're untransformed oh, stats. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, Jacob, at least... Let me try to... Or, let... Let's just check on the wiki if they are actually good or not. Mmm, sure. If I remember correctly, Janeth is the good one and Ulti is the shitty one. Really now? Yeah, because Janeth transforms right away, but Ulti doesn't. Alright, uh, let's uh, let's debate who is better, at least both of them in Radiant Dawn. Yeah, let me, let me judge that. Let's see, um... That's Path of Radiance. Here's Radiant Dawn. Um, let's see. Um, Janeth has good, um, good um, base stats, and it carries him through the entire game. Um, let's see. The only ta two things that hinder him are his Lagoo's Gauge and his lack of 1 to 2 range. Okay. Um... Okay, well, here's here's basically what you're getting. Um, let's see. Olki has better speed, and Janov has better strength and defense. Yeah, I can see that, even though Janov is one, one speed below. So, I mean, honestly, they're both pretty equal. Just depends if you'd rather bring just one of them or bring both of them up to you. Yeah, but <laughs> but there are so many goodness, good units that I really don't want to leave. Mm -hmm. Leave off. I mean, some of most of the units I'm not going to use. I, I mean, potentially I might use Har or Shinnin. Though I really do need to use Shinnin. Well, I say swap out maybe Olki or Janna for Shinnin then. Depends, you want more speed or do you want more attack? <laughs> I'll probably rely on speed if I want to double and survive. So, so yeah, you'd want Olki then. And then you can throw in Shinnin. <laughs> yeah, but like I said, I really want him to get the double bow. Because oh. look at look at his bow rank. He is really He hasn't even leveled up freaking the bow stat. Yep, so now's your chance to do that. Alright, Jacob. Only one one more chapter to till we end the day. Or at least the night. Yeah, well we're at we're at two hours, so hopefully it doesn't take too long. But this time it's not super late, so I don't really mind that much, and I don't have to go anywhere. Good start. Okay, these I have to avoid. Uh, it's so cool seeing this map in the original version. Aw, oh, shit, Jacob. What? I forgot to give her daggers. Oh. <laughs> you have any in the convoy? No. Sh should I reset? Um... Can't you... Can't, you already, so you already started, you can't change now? No. Oh, uh, yeah, you should probably do a battle save then.
Uh, let's pause. All right. All right. Now Heather has weapons. Just to make sure. Yep, they're the same. Good. Thanks. There we go. <laughs> Bird up. So I'm guessing the birds will be good for this chapter. Maybe. I mean, if they give you the birds, they're probably going to be good. You want to see what knife does? Sure. There. Is it going to be like Yunaka, where she throws it at them? Nice. Also, look at this background. This is dope. This has to be what the Castle Siege stage in Smash is based on. Oh, I'm sure it is. But honestly, I have no I haven't even seen where... Where is the exact location of the Castle Siege, because... Every Fire Emblem game that I played, I don't think there was any mention of the Castle Siege. <laughs> Look at what you made me do. I think my favorite part is the wavy effect on the screen. That's so cool. Yeah, it's because of the lava. Amazing tension to detail. That's the kind of shit I'm putting into my Super Mario Bros. X level. <laughs> we are halfway of this section, by the way. Yeah, I imagine this chapter isn't very long, right? I don't think so. But just don't count on me on what I say, okay? Alright, I will count on what you say. <laughs> it's... Hey, look, my phone's actually charging instantly for once. And not taking ten minutes to register that it's actually on the cable. <laughs> Check up. My phone automatically charges. Well, good for you. Yeah. It's not a great phone, but... What phone is it's, it? It's it's a Samsung phone. Yeah, which one? <laughs> I can't remember what model it is. Cause I have a cause I have a Galaxy S10. Oh, thank goodness I have a box for what the model of my phone is. It's a Galaxy A five four five G. Hmm. I'll look that one up then. I'll see what brand, what model that is. Oh, you're gonna head out, Zeppi? Okay, I'll see ya. Yeah, I'll... like I said, it's a Galaxy A54 5G. Mm, A54 5G. The Galaxy A54 5G is a mid range Android smartphone that came out in 2023. Yeah, my phone. Yeah, my phone is recent, basically. Hmm. Well, it's more recent than mine, because mine I got in 2022. <laughs> I actually had this in November of 2023. Nice. Yeah, after my phone break, I've, I've broken a lot of phones, and my parents get angry at me for that. <laughs> That's not good. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I could understand why they get angry at me for that. I mean, I'm gonna hold on to this phone as long as I possibly can. Like, the only reason why I axed my other phone is because the charger broke. Like, it couldn't charge anymore. One of the worst things that ever happened to my other phones is that some some of them fall down and crack. My, f my screen crack and I just throw it. So you have, no, then... you have no screen protection. Oh, I do! It's just that the screen protection is not enough. Oh. And sometimes it can break inside. You don't have enough good- you don't have a good enough phone case, then. Yeah, pretty much. Basically, the phone can break the circuits inside. Cause I, I have- cause I have a phone case now, and I like it. I have my Neptunia phone case that I bought myself. <laughs> Since when? 
Well, I, I went on a website called, I think it's called Redbubble, and I found a, I found a phone case that has the Neptunia logo on it. I wish I could have a phone that has a Xenogear logo. I mean, that probably exists. If you, maybe I can find one, actually. Maybe. I, I haven't been on Redbubble in a long time, but I could check. That's okay. This sounds like a fun pastime. Well, at least I could get this really good music in the background. Yeah. Yeah. But like I said, I really love this music so much. Not the Devoted, but... The map music? <laughs> yeah, Gathering Storms. I really love this music a lot. I mean, sure, you may not find it appealing, but I really love the appeal to this music with the different instruments that it has. Yeah. Especially the one part where it plays similar to a music box. That's what I like. I'm sure you haven't heard battle themes that uses music boxes. Now that's pretty cool. Hmm. How do I search for phone cases on mobile? Remember that one last dream? Where, where freaking Shinnen keeps critting with the freaking ballista. <laughs> that was pretty funny. That is one of the highlights of oh, Radiant Dawn. Come on, Mommy Titania. You are made for greatness. Right. <laughs> I don't remember how to use this website, but hey, you can get a Xeno Gears T-shirt <laughs> with the with the with the X on it. Sure, I wouldn't mind that. Or you or you could get a Xeno Gears T-shirt with the Sophia painting on it for twenty four dollars. <laughs> Honestly, that doesn't sound bad. Yeah. I mean, it's not amazing. It's just like it's just literally that that it's just literally a JPEG of the Sophia painting on a white T-shirt. Yeah. Or you can get one with Faye on it. Sure, I like me some Faye. What if I look up Xeno Gears phone case? If there isn't any, then try Xenosaga, since I'm sure it has more popularity than Xenogears. And Dang I somehow it. got hit. I somehow got hit by a freaking weak 20%. How, how does that feel? Am <laughs> I going to get hit again by 20%? No. No. You're just going to keep daunting, aren't you? Why does Soren get so many bad luck? Damn, poor Soren. How do I search for a very specific phone case? Oh shit. Yeah, I think Soren needs. I mean, Shinnen needs more strength. Because he is not going to hit hard with the freaking bow gun. Do I have one for the, uh... No, they only have the Galaxy S series. Weird. Oh yeah, and Jacob, this will be the last time you will hear the Devoted. Hmm, damn, I guess something important is gonna happen in the game, huh? Pretty much. The next, the next, the next battle theme will be more tense than the devoted. Just for heads up. Do they really only have the Samsung Galaxy S phones? Weird. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate.
I don't see anything for the A54 5G. Unless there's... Unless the A54 phone case is similar or something else. Also, Jacob, I have some good news. What? I might rewatch Back to the Future again. Hmm. I, I just love that series. I mean, it's a good thing that that movie is so rewatchable. Wasn't that movie always rewatchable? It's about as rewatchable as the Star Wars movies. I mean, it's as rewatchable as Toy Story. Yeah. At least the first three movies. Or, or Terminator. Well, well, both one and two. Yeah. I am tempted to, tempted to go back to watching Terminator again. I might have to as well. I haven't seen them in like 10 years. I haven't seen it since my high school years. Long time. You know, since like the cough cough years. <laughs> the cough cough years. Uh... Too bad Brom didn't even one one round the freaking mage. But hey. <laughs> He's strong, and he has a lot of speed. That's all you need from an armor knight, right? Yep. The funny thing is that armor knights are at their best in this series. What, they fall after? Uh, they fall off after this? Yeah, you could say that, especially during the Awakening era. Well, actually, they don't fall off too far from Awakening since... Not since Awakening's generals are not that good. And look, Titania heals back. Hey, good for her. It's basically, whenever Soul is used, you can actually get more damage. You literally get more damage from using soul and heal. Well, it's basically a crit that heals you. Well, sort of, but not entirely. Doesn't cr In other don't, words, don't crits do three times as much, well, though? Well, it's better saying that it crits just like Luna. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's basically similar to Luna. <laughs> She's going to impale! <laughs> impale that guy, yeah. You see why I love Nephany so much? <laughs> Hold up, who got who got an item drop? Mm. Worm. Oh, I oh, oh I do need another Yeah, I do need another crossbow, even though that's from a warrior. Yeah, I think being too reckless is not a good idea. If I send e everybody down to their maximum space, then... Yeah. I'm trying to find phone cases that fit the A54. I'm not too sure. I really hope we get, I get Ragnell in after this chapter. Yeah, that'd be nice. Hmm. Okay, good. At least it's still in maximum use. For now. Ah! <laughs> nice. Suck my ads. Because that 8% damage is not that good. Lol. I mean... I think... Ooh, she got speed. And defense. Very nice. At this point, she's gonna max out speed. Yeah, and Effany's gonna be constantly doubling then. Oh yeah, that's right, she broke her Great Lance. Oh yeah, and I had to sell some skills just to get more items. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure those skills won't be that useful anyways. That's perfect damage. Uh, 
I get sniped. Wait, is Epi sent more sauce? Never get tired of sauce. Mm, yeah, let me have a look. Except for that pepperoni cheesecake. <laughs> the pepperoni cheesecake. Well, instead of pepperoni cheesecake, we got more dragon booba. Ooh, I like that. That's that's good stuff right there. We got Ivy and Camilla again. <laughs> I take Ivy any day over Camilla. Ivy's good. I like Ivy. I think I'm. I don't know. It's hard to say. I might like Ivy more than Camilla. Maybe it's just because I've actually watched Engage, so I'm a bit more biased. The only thing I liked about Camilla was her funny little pose that what Zeppi gave to everybody. <laughs> nice job. Because Camilla has like a specific pose where she like gets all curvy and stuff, and <laughs> he gave that to a bunch of people. Like I think he gave it to, I think he gave it to Gold Mary. I also tried giving it to Coke Chan, who <laughs> looked a little funny on her. Egg up. Sometimes curve isn't enough for me. <laughs> I may be picky, yes, but but I will say that sometimes curve and bus will not be enough. What you need, you need ass too. That also, but <laughs> I also need, but I also need a character that's more loving and compelling. Yeah, it's sort of. A... Well, Camilla's loving and compelling. <laughs> no, she's like I told you before, she's psychotic. But she loves corn. <laughs> Who the fuck cares about corn? <laughs> yeah, I mean, corn is in Garen Quest. Well, let me rephrase that. I want a character who is at least complex. Who is basically like a savior of some sorts. So, like Makoto Yuki? Yeah, like Makoto Yuki. <laughs> that was the first thing that came to mind. When you said savior, I mean, it's like, I immediately thought of Messiah. So I was like, oh yeah, Makoto Yuki. Yeah. I mean, at least at least that's more relevant now because I recently played Persona 3 again. Even though Makoto Yuki can't talk, he at least has his own character, by the way. Yeah, he has a surprising amount of character despite the fact that he can't talk. You know what they always say, he's a man with a few words. That's literally a saying, really. And as they also say, actions speak louder than words. <laughs> People usually prefer words over actions. Not Makoto Yuki, though. <laughs> nice double hit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I realize she might get damage on the next turn. I think. Ooh. See Yes! Okay, that's good. If I max out both speed and and strength, I am going to focus on her defense and resistance. She is close to maxing both of those stats. Very good. You should also realize that my Titania is actually better than my Path of Radiance Titania. Yeah, she got buffed. Alright, the 227 mark. Although, I don't know about the recording. I think the recording is a little bit behind 227. Because we did pause. Now it's time for the Lagoose turn. Ah. 28 strength, 30, 36 <laughs> speed. <laughs> That's some good speed. Yeah, he's gonna double pretty much always. He he has as much speed as Heather does now. I think we're. Oh, getting, no. I feel like we're getting close to the end of the map. We are. I really wish you could hear the freaking next map theme. Oh, yeah. I mean, or at least the next battle theme. Well, the next map theme, too. <laughs> We're still gonna get Ike's theme on the next map. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. Bra and Ephany got more support. Well, 
Well, Zeppi sending sauce definitely improved the stream, that's for sure. <laughs> honestly, honestly, more people should do that. When I'm streaming, just, like, send me good shit. Send me good sauce, and I'll, I'll, I'll just pause what I'm doing and look at it. It doesn't have to be from just Zeppi. Anybody can do it. I don't really care. Oh, yeah, and I also forgot to mention that I want my waifu to be badass. <laughs> like, Kotsmos, for example. She is fucking badass. I'm a badass waifu, huh? Yep. And she's a robot. But not only is she a robot, uh... There is something underneath that, uh... That all that freaking... You know... What am I trying to say? What I'm trying to say is that underneath, she... She, she actually has some enhancements of another person who lived a long time ago. <laughs> the Xeno <Basically>, the <laughs> lore. <laughs> well, Jacob, the Xeno lore is... Well, heavily on religious themes, You, I will say. <laughs> Good to know. Jacob, most JRPGs does use use religion as some sort of theme to it. I mean, yeah, take Megami Tensei, for example. <laughs> it's all about the- it's all about the mythology and the religion. Well, on the topic of badass waifus, <laughs> I know one. <laughs> in my opinion, in my opinion, uh, an example of, an, of a badass waifu would be Iffy. <laughs> Who cares about Iffy, anyways? Well, I do. And... I think the reason I like her so much is that... She just, like... She gives no fucks. She's very, like... She's kind of like Ike, where she just wants to, like, you know, get shit done. <laughs> and she can also use fire magic, and that's cool. Basically, what I'm trying to say is that Cosmos inherits... Inter inherits the memories of someone similar to I'm sure you know I'm sure you know who is similar to that Cloud Strife who inherits the memories of freaking Zack yeah I wonder where my, my, my Megan Gaga sound is so yeah Cosmos yeah. is basically like that but basically Cosmos no. is like that but there is actually more to it than inherit than inheriting someone's memories. She she is also the lover of the Messiah. That's all I'm about to say. <laughs> I don't know where my Megan Gaga sound is. It's not that. Also, Jacob, I just like to apologize for getting annoyed. What? My sound effects? Yeah, I am really sorry if I sound rude to you. I'm gonna give me some of these. Yeah, it's okay. Guys, guys, don't go. I have been stressed for the past few days. What is it about the ISP again? No, it's no, it's my hearing. Oh yeah, the swimmer's here. Yeah. That's why I got isolated for the past few days. But don't worry, I'm over with the ISP thing. Well, that's good. I don't know. I don't. <laughs> I don't know where the Megan Gaga sound is. Well, I do have this though. Cancer, cancer, cancer. <laughs> cancer. I'm gonna give me some Why are you You know, Jacob, I am getting used to the freaking plain dead penis penis thing. <laughs> I haven't even quoted that in a while. I just actually played that. I know. I'm just saying that I'm used to it at this point. Alright, found it, yes. <laughs> What's wrong with you? But what I'm, 
but after this, we should talk about soundboards for a little bit after the stream is finished. Well, you, want, well, you want me to add something to the soundboard? Yeah, just later, after the stream is over. Like pepperoni cheesecake, for example. Pepperoni cheesecake. <laughs> you want to know where I heard the oh wow sound sound from? Where? Johnny Test in a Nutshell. <laughs> Johnny Test in a Nutshell? Oh wow. Yeah, that that's exactly where, where I heard that from. <laughs> now I need to see that. Too bad that crossbow ain't gonna do shit. Dang. <laughs> Dang. Hey, at least it doubled. Oh wow, wow. But at least I could get the opportunity to level up my weapon rank. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no
Yeah, great. Great. Just heal. Just heal. Fuck fucking heal. Why the fuck not? Yeah, like that 1% hit rate. That's not gonna hit. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, you're not hitting. I don't know. You're gonna die by Deadeye anyway. Yeah, get Deadeye. Come on. Yeah, with Worm? That's not gonna help. That's not gonna help. I told you. Yeah. You have Deadeye! Yeah. I love that he just jumps up into the air and shoots it. Like he's fucking Ryu Hayabusa. That's Deadeye for you, man. Yeah. Hey, I got a good level up, too. Level up. Wait, I just noticed when that guy died, he had the sleep status. Does Deadeye put people to sleep? I don't think so. Damn it, Ileana, you gotta dance harder than that. <laughs> That's an even worse hit rate! <laughs> 25. <laughs> oh. Think. Get Deadeye. <laughs> we got a crit! <laughs> <laughs> He's been getting crits every day. <laughs> Chris every day. That could be another funny title. We got so many good titles this week. <laughs> Chris every day. Okay, he got a lucky hit. I like I like Bane of Your Existence better. Is he going to get a hit? Nope. Well, apparently misses at thirty six. Nope. Well. I got hit by 22. How does that even no. work? No. 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 He's dead. What's wrong with him? <laughs> he died. <laughs> he died. I'm gonna give you some. It's too bad El Thunder, Thunder won't work. Yeah, throw knives at the armor, the armor man, or kill that healer. You're not sure. I hate healers anyways. Well, not Mist. Yeah, Mist is good. And Laura. We like Mist and Laura, and that's about it. And Rez, I could not- I can honestly care less about. Hey, 39 speed! <laughs> She's close to maxing out speed. Actually, there's actually three stats she's close to maxing out. <laughs> Heather's pretty much just gonna max out everything. She's going to max out strength, freaking defense, speed, and res. <laughs> yeah, sure. Come on, get dead eye. Oh, that, 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 that works too. Even though that's not a kill, I'm <laughs> fine with it. Do you still think that the biorhythm is good? Uh, the biorhythm is honestly still a pretty mid system. Jacob, the the biorhythm literally affects everybody. I know. You want to know how? <laughs> he has bad biorhythm. Yeah, he's getting crits and shit all the time. And Ike has a good biorhythm. Yeah, if you want biorhythm to work effectively, just play freaking uh I don't know, hard mode. Bullshit mode. <laughs> yeah, bullshit mode. <laughs> oh yeah, so I we're gonna call to it. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that bullshit mode doesn't have weapon triangles. Oh, well that's kinda lame. Yeah, basically you can hit anybody. Okay, so not only is it bullshit mode, but it's also mid mode. <laughs> because you're getting rid of, like, the entire point of Fire Emblem. You know, Gaiden didn't even have weapon triangles. Well, Il Nephany says impale that shit. You know what, that's fine. <laughs> Yo, know, she maxes out speed? <laughs> she did! Wow, good on you, Nephany. My Nephany is also gonna be this strong. Yeah, you got a good Nephany. 
I could argue that she that this Nephany in this game is much better. God damn it, Soren, I wish you could level up speed. God damn it, Soren. Well, the thing is is that Soren really needs three more speed stats just to max out his speed. Hey, he's still faster than than uh he's still faster than Micaiah. Got him. Yeah, I guess you're right about that. Maybe this could help. Just maybe. I just want to help freaking Soren. <laughs> 23 hit rate. Even though they are going to get hit by the freaking meteor showers. Mm, they can tank it. Thorin really is in a need for speed. That <laughs> need for speed. No! <laughs> Fuck you, Soren. You know what? You don't... Ileana's gonna get the experience now. Actually, no, she's not, because she's not gonna kill him. Oh shit, he's actually coming over to attack. Oh shit. Oh no, he missed. Good. Good, he should miss. Alright, attempt number two at trying to have Soren get a good level up. If attempt number two fails, then I hate Soren. Well, his HP again, then it's probably scripted. Think, yeah. As I thought. Well, you can always try next turn. Well, you know what? I think he deserves the kill. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? If Soren doesn't get the need for speed, then I don't see why not. He, this guy's gonna flex his speed. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna flex his speed. He's flexing the need oh. for speed. Need now for... it's time to call the mages. He's need for speed is most wanted. Look how powerful Brom is. Bro's a menace. He can literally kill any mages. I mean, he not only that, but he tanks the mages. Ooh. I just realized tomorrow is free Slurpee day. I'm not big on Slurpees. Me neither, but I'll take it if it's free. <laughs> Bro's Honestly, dead. You know what's better than a Slurpee? What? Milkshakes. Mmm, I do like milkshakes. My favorite is cookies and cream milkshake. I don't think I've ever had a cookies and cream milkshake. You should get cookies and cream milkshakes. They are fantastic. My question is, where would I even find one? I don't even know, to be honest. I usually get them at Chick-fil-A. Yeah, well, I'm not Maruka. I don't have Chick-fil-A. <laughs> there, there's, there's Chick-fil-A locations in Canada. Well, I've never seen any. <laughs> Maybe you're... Maybe you're just far away. Maybe. I never seen them in BC or Alberta, so I don't know. You wanna know what's worse? What? Burger King is closing down in America. Damn, why? What did Burger King ever do? Well, the thing is is that uh they they're going bankrupt, I will say. Damn really? How? I think so. I I honestly don't know, to be honest. I, I literally can't even find a single Burger King in my location. Is Burger King shutting down? Burger King has announced plans to close up to 400 locations by the end of 2023. So they're not going bankrupt, they're just shutting down some places. 
I literally think they are going bankrupt. It's just, why would they ever need to close down? It says there are no plans to shut down the chain entirely. So no, they're not going bankrupt. They're just shutting down some some Burger Kings to save on money, I guess. Or something, I don't know. That's still questionable in my opinion. It is weird. It's, it's the first I've heard. He's still got the HP level up. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with Soren? <laughs> Come on, Soren. I... Give me a need for speed. I want speed. Yeah, bang your music again. At least I have a good excuse to use this music again. <laughs> Plus one HP. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Soren. That's gonna be the I... thumbnail. The thumbnail is just gonna be Soaring Game plus one HP. Fuck you, Soren. <laughs> Man, it's, for, it's for, no for, wonder. For the so called good strategist, he sure doesn't get a lot of good level ups. And he doesn't get the need for speed. <laughs> well, I can give him a need for speed next chapter. I mean, you know, what, you, I mean, what, you, what you can do is you can give him the bonus XP. Yeah, that's the best I could do. Think. <laughs> you know, Soren is literally disrespecting me so hard. <laughs> You're being rude, Soren. Heather gets the kill instead. Yeah, Heather deserves kills than Soren does. I mean, it's all right, like. Well, Jacob, I have no comments. <laughs> I have no comments either. Soren, want to try out our fighting as a team? Don't worry, I'll slow down a bit, so if you can keep up... I am not inconvenienced by that plan. <laughs> that is a very Soren thing to say, Jesus. My god. Pew pew. <laughs> well, there are only two more units left. Two guys left to kill. That mage is dead either way. Uh, wrong sound effect. Not, not a good time, EDP. <laughs> What's what sound effects are you trying to? I was trying I was trying to play um this one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, sorry. You want to try and fight the boss? You know what? He's gonna say yes. Hey, at least at least he gets healed up. Good job, missed. Yeah, it looks like Elwin's still the best. They told me that there's there's lasagna. <laughs> and pepperoni cheesecake. The only thing I'd have to do was carry their dead bodies back as proof. It's just my luck that the enemy is live and well. Why does this always happen to me?
Ooh, Adept. That's a good time for that to kick in. Yeah. What, is he gonna Ooh. level up properly? Yeah! yeah. Yes, he, all it, he all it, finally all, all it took was him getting Adept to get a good level up. And I guess uh, Heather can steal the show, like Joker. Well, she's my queen. She'll, she'll better get. She better get a good level up after this. Speed up. Yeah, she maxed out speed. Let's go. That's a good. Okay, that's fine. a good way to end the episode. I I knew it. I knew I would end up like pepperoni cheesecake. <laughs> oh yeah, I dig it. Like we're going to show it. <laughs> Wait, the nutshell episode. They're kicking. The, they're they're kicking the shit out of them. Ike, Ranulf, this way. I found a way out. Here we go. Here we go. Let's have a look. Oh, Booba. Johnny Test in a nutshell. Robbie Test, and I am a dumb boy that gets in trouble. <laughs> I am Doobie the dog, and I am Ronnie's talking pet. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, dude! This is literally watch... <laughs> just watch the entire video. Video. <laughs> no. Blam blam. Oh no. I save you. Who? Who? Do, Great video. <laughs> do I recognize this YouTuber at all? Do you? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Johnny Test in a nutshell. No, this is just a completely different person. The one who did the Kirby's Return to Dreamland nutshell video, because that no. has the it, that has the exact same voice and no, the exact no. same style. Yeah. Okay, interesting. Yeah, it's just a different it YouTuber. Made, it might have been made by the same person. This is just a re-upload. Maybe. Excellent. Let's get. I. Uh... You don't have to. <laughs> you don't need to tell us twice. <laughs> yes, we did it. We made it through the caves. Looks like we finally lost the Benyon army as well. We could finally arrest it. Also, why are they like opening their mouths like that? That's weird. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> At this point, Skipper's gonna call Ike Kowalski. <laughs> <laughs> Kowalski. I thought we were finished, Kowalski. I thought my rashness had killed us, but we've lived to see our land again. Oh, Captain Falcon's fine though. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, hey, Skipper. Has the heat gone to the shaggy head of yours? Look around. This is Gallia. What? No, we can't be in. Hey, you! By those authority, have you entered this land? Gildo, the land of those dragons. Why the goddess did we fuck up, man? Those dragons, it is said that they are the most powerful of all the Lagoos traps, Private. I've always wanted to fight a dragon, but I've never expected it would happen like this. When our king finds out about this, I will have much explaining to do. You've got to get home first, Skipper. I guess we have to pay it. I guess we have to pay that stubborn old lizard a visit, don't we? Gex? Let's go. Yeah, Gex. Gex. I can't believe Gex is in Radiant Dawn, dude. Neither do I. <laughs> Castle Goldoa. Flute. Are the, you gonna see him again? It's the Mario flute. <laughs> there he is! 
There he is, Steve Harvey. <laughs> Steve Harvey. The king of family feud. And there you have it. We never intended to violate Goldola's borders. It was an accident. Oh yeah, and Jacob, by the way. What? Once we see him again. Yeah, we will see him again. Ooh, we'll see him again. Yeah, but under different circumstances. Oh shit, he's evil? Damn. Yeah, and he's gonna be really tough. Dang. He does look evil, though. He's got, like, a black cape and a mustache and a scar on his head. Yeah, that says a lot. But he is gonna be the toughest... He's gonna be the toughest, toughest boss fight you'll ever see. Wow. I didn't know Steve Harvey was the most OP Fire Emblem character. Yeah, just wait... Just wait and see his his stats. Even though I kind of spoil spoil that he's a villain, but I'm not gonna spoil spoil his stats or when <laughs> he'll. Do. I can't wait. Uh, well, you're also not spoiling his weapons or his skills or any of that. Yeah, true. But I will say that he is gonna be a tough son of a bitch. Oh, I don't think he read that. <laughs> I did. I see. I understand your your predicament. However, your reasons neither justify nor change the fact that you trespass on our territory. I order you to leave immediately. Go back the way you came through those caves. <laughs> oh, right. That's me. <laughs> you would never have us go through the cock caves again. Never. Stop talking, Skipper. Many of my men are wounded. You're sending them to their deaths. I'll not allow this. It is regrettable, yes. <laughs> However, survey says I cannot make exceptions. How can a Lagoons be so cold to his brothers? We, we are your people as well. This is a new skimmer. <laughs> Family Sk <feeling>. Skimmer? <laughs> <laughs> it's Skipper, yes. No, you you, you said skimmer. skimmer. <laughs> yes, yeah, Skipper, Skimmer, whatever. This is a new Skipper. Family Feud and its lizards of families ignored the suffering of their Lagoose brothers for centuries. They even looked the other way while we, birds and beasts, were enslaved by Barok. Isn't that so, Dragon King? Our country's neutral. It's been since time out of my mind, and I'll continue to do so. Oh, n nice change in music. Then you might as well just kill us now. It'd be the same as sending us back to the cock caves, and it saves us the walk. You are a Barok. I would not expect your short-lived kind to understand. I don't need to understand to see that as a poor king has so little regard for his fellow living creatures. Hmm. Your Majesty, please hear our plea. What are you two doing here? Please allow my grandfather and me to guide the Lagoos Alliance to the borders of Gallia. I beg of you. Wait, so Anna and Nasir both lived? How is that possible? <laughs> so, is this the, uh, wasn't, wasn't this the canon ending where, like, the Black Knight escaped or whatever and Nasir lived? Well, in this case, uh, I didn't defeat the Black Knight and Nasir was killed. But he's right here. <laughs> But it's canon in my maniac mode. Well, not canon in this playthrough, though, because he's right there. Prince Raisin of the Heron tribe stands among these men. The Jagged tribe owes him a safe passage. Please, your majesty, he saved the soul of your son. Would you condemn them to die despite the good they've done? Hmm. Do as you like. Survey says this is the only exception I'll ever make. Thank you, Your Majesty. I love the idea of just giving Steve Harvey, like, ding or buzzer noises every time he talks. <laughs> well, here you are. I think you know the way from here. Thanks, Nasir. You really saved us back there. It's the least we could do. I'll pray for your safety. And then Ike just walks off. Alright. That's uh that's a good note to end it on. I think I think Wait, we'll, Do you wanna Wait. watch this? 
Yes. But I don't want to could but I don't want to end off the same way as what happened the last time. Okay. No foreigner like Hoover's will be will be is permitted within its borders. Borders borders. borders. Emerges from the lava tubes and into Goldoa by <laughs> There he is. King de Gincia is displeased by this trespass. Yeah, uh, I mean I think you mean Steve Harvey. However, Ike's former companions, Nasir and Ina, appealed to the Ina? <laughs> Not Anna? Okay. Ina's actions during the last war earned them the grudging respect of King Degincia, who allows them safe passage. I like Anna better. Sounds better. Meanwhile, Benyan calls off its pursuit of the Alliance and finds its passage into Gallia blocked mm -hmm. by the nation's great mountains and deep forests. The central army's momentum breaks upon these obstacles like an ocean wave against solid rock. Yeah, like Senator wave ocean. He arrives to take command of the central army. He orders Zelgius to march on to Gallia by way of Kronos. Yeah, that's fucking weirdo. <gasps> Alencia! Valtome petitions the queen for passage. Heck yes, Alencia. Supplies and additional troops. Queen Alencia, however... Queen Alencia is so fucking smoking hot. And resolutely <laughs> denies... Valencia was always hot. <laughs> Her reply enrages Valtome, who sees Crimea. <laughs> Her reply enrages him. Ignoring Zelgius's counsel, Valtome orders his army to enter Crimea. Valtome. Whatever they need from the villages along the way. Definitely a bad guy name. <laughs> Chapter 9, Marauders. Oh, burp, burp, God. Burp, burp. There's still more cutscene. Your Majesty, the Benyan armies crossed the border, dude. There's Mexicans everywhere. They're seizing food and supplies and calling a tribute to the Taco Bell. There are no casualties yet, but they are acting like bandits. I see. Wait, wait, wait did, did I avoid? Did, I, you voiced no, her, right? I voiced her, yes. Oops, it's been a bit. <laughs> Something simply ignored me. What shall I tell the troops, Your Majesty? Your order the order the knight order the royal knights to mobilize, ride out, and advise Benyon to withdraw. If they do not comply, I approve the use of force to remove them from our land. <laughs> But, you, but your majesty, this is the Benyon army we are talking about. It would be unwise to provoke them. I had hoped to avoid this situation, but the Empire's attempts to strong, ar to strong arm... Arm strong. Our people, <laughs> strong. Our people shall not go unanswered. Deploying the Royal Knights is the only way to protect our borders from in incursion. However, I remained open to suggestions... Do you have any alternative plans of actions, Lord Sauron? Oh, no. Please forgive my impertinence. Your Majesty is quite right. Why not give him the Jackie Chu voice? <laughs> yeah, the Jackie Chu voice. You dumb! I'm glad we are in agree agreement, Lord Jackie Chu. <laughs> this situation... This whole situation disturbs me greatly. I wonder what happens to the Empire. I find your lack of faith disturbing. I doubt the Apostle would allow this sort of thing to happen. We should prepare for the worst. I fear something horrible must happen with Benyon. Benyon's onions. <laughs> Benyon's onions. <laughs> okay, now we can save. Villagers. <laughs> Alencia. You got a master crown, another one. And 10,000 moon knees. Hell 10, yeah. 10,000 gold. Now we're back to the freaking Crimean army. Wow, with a whole lot of nobodies. <laughs> okay, we got we, okay, we got Dan, De Deb Dan, and Dan Ved, and Khalil, and, and Marcia, Khalil. and um, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. And uh, that's about it. Hey, dude, you want some cool stuff? Like an arm scroll?
nobody can support. Wow, okay. Yeah, support? Right, What's that? No support. I guess it's a good time to save. That's a good place to call it a day. We've been recording for three hours and five minutes. This time, I'm not too... I'm not too upset about that, because that went pretty well. We got three chapters done instead of two. So, the three hours is honestly warranted, I'd say. Yeah, pretty much. So, this so was a good, good episode. episode. Yep, good episode. I'm happy with that. Me too. Um, and I guess the next time we can play Radiant Dawn will be like, um, I don't know, maybe Sunday, Monday, yeah, I'm not hopefully. sure. Hopefully those days, since we're not going to do anything special on those days. Yeah, I'm like probably going to cancel Book of Mario unless I can get a lot of people to show up for that, because nobody's been showing up for that. So I'm just going to probably put on hiatus and just we could do other things on Sunday that are more interesting. Like, yeah, we could do um, more Radiant Dawn, uh, maybe continue MGS2. Uh, who knows? I think those op options are fine, I guess. Actually, yeah, that's what we should do on Sunday. We should have you catch up on MGS2. I'll should, try, but we should, we I'm should not get gonna you up to the Harrier. I'm not going to promise that, though. Alright. Alright, well, that was fun, though. I had, a, I had a good time tonight, despite the, you know, soundboard shenanigans and yeah, all that. Yeah, the soundboard shenanigans. There is something that I got to talk to you about after the stream is over. Sure. Well, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. And uh, tomorrow morning, I will probably go shopping again, and uh, I might do more Neptunia, so. Okay, that's yeah. fine if you do Neptunia. Yeah, I'll see you guys then.